Hi everyone, welcome back to the Simpler Learn YouTube channel. Today we are entering a realm where a few lines of code can bring down corporations, empty bank accounts, shut off power grids, and even cause international chaos. The world of hacking is not just about curiosity or pranks. It is a battlefield filled with masterminds who operate in shadows, leaving behind digital footprints that trigger global investigations. In this video, we are counting down the top 10 most dangerous hackers in the world. Individuals and groups whose actions created financial losses in the hundreds of millions, exposed state secrets, and pushed the boundaries of what one person can do from behind a keyboard. Before we dive in, make sure you hit like, share this video, subscribe to the channel, and comment below which hacker you think will make the top three. Your support helps the channel grow and keeps these deep dive stories coming your way. Now get ready because the digital underworld is far stranger and far more powerful than most people ever realize. 10. Kevin Mitnick, The Ghost in the Wires Kevin Mitnick is often called the most elusive hacker of the early internet age. In his prime, he infiltrated the systems of companies such as Motorola, Nokia, Sun Microsystems, and Pacific Bell. The FBI estimated his breaches caused millions in damages through system disruptions and stolen source code. What made him uniquely dangerous was his mastery of social engineering. He convinced employees to hand over passwords simply by sounding authoritative. At one point, he cloned Motorola's proprietary software for mobile phones, a tool worth millions in research. Mitnick was arrested in 1995 after years on the run and later transformed into a respected cybersecurity consultant. His legend reminds the world that sometimes the biggest vulnerability is human trust. 9. Guccifer the lone wolf who breached governments. Guccifer, the Romanian hacker known for operating alone, shocked the world by infiltrating the email accounts of high-level political figures. His targets included former U.S. government officials, diplomats, and military personnel. He exposed private communications, personal photos, and confidential documents. Authorities reported that his intrusions led to widespread security audits and millions in defensive cybersecurity costs. What made him terrifying was his method. He relied on simple password guessing and relentless persistence rather than sophisticated malware. His attacks proved that even the most powerful individuals can be compromised through basic human oversight. 8. Anonymous, the Decentralized Digital Uprising Anonymous is not a single person, but a collective of loosely affiliated hackers spread across the world. Their operations have struck government websites, global corporations, extremist organizations, and financial institutions. One of their most infamous actions was Operation Payback in 2010, which targeted companies and agencies that opposed internet freedom. Their distributed attacks took down major payment processors, costing organizations millions in downtime and mitigation efforts. Anonymous also infiltrated extremist groups' communication channels, exposing members and disrupting operations. Their lack of structure makes them unpredictable. Anyone can operate under the anonymous name, and that unpredictability gives them an almost mythic level of influence. 7. Lizard Squad, the group that broke the internet for fun. Lizard Squad became globally known for shutting down major gaming networks. Their attacks on PlayStation Network and Xbox Live during high traffic periods caused massive outages. Millions of users were locked out of their online games during holiday seasons, and the targeted companies faced large financial losses due to service interruptions and emergency security improvements. They did not stop at gaming. Lizard Squad claimed responsibility for attacks on airline websites and even hinted at threats that caused flight delays. Their actions revealed how vulnerable large consumer networks were to denial of service attacks and created ripple effects across the tech industry. Six. Gary McKinnon, the curious hacker who triggered global panic. Gary McKinnon, a British systems administrator, infiltrated nearly 100 US military and NASA computers over the course of a year. He claimed he was searching for evidence of UFO technology and government cover-ups. The US government accused him of deleting critical files, shutting down systems, and interfering with military networks. Estimates stated his actions caused over $700,000 in damages not counting the long-term cost of upgrading and securing the affected networks. McKinnon insisted he was exploring, not sabotaging. Regardless of motive, his intrusions exposed serious weaknesses in some of the most sensitive digital infrastructure in the world. 
Five, Adrian Lamo, the homeless hacker who exposed secrets. Adrian Lamo earned his nickname because he traveled frequently and often hacked from public locations like libraries. He gained notoriety by breaching the New York Times, Microsoft, Yahoo, and other major organizations. He accessed internal databases, personal records of staff, and unpublished articles. His estimates of financial damage range in the millions due to system repairs, audits, and new cybersecurity measures. Lamo became even more famous for reporting Chelsea Manning to the authorities after Manning shared classified military documents with him. His role in that case sparked intense global debate about ethics, loyalty, and the responsibilities of hackers. Four, Albert Gonzalez, the architect of massive credit card theft. Albert Gonzalez masterminded one of the largest financial data theft operations in history. Working with accomplices, he penetrated major retail networks and stole more than 170 million credit and debit card numbers. He used a combination of SQL injection, wireless network exploits, and custom sniffing tools to collect financial data. His victims included major retailers such as TJX companies and other high-profile stores. Authorities estimated that the total cost of his crimes reached hundreds of millions of dollars in restitution, fraud losses, and security upgrades. Gonzalez treated cybercrime like a business and became one of the first hackers to industrialize identity theft on a massive scale. Three, the Lazarus Group, the nation-backed cyber army. Lazarus Group is believed to operate with the support of a national government, which makes them one of the most sophisticated and dangerous hacking units on Earth. Their operations have included bank heists, destructive malware attacks, espionage campaigns, and politically motivated cyber operations. One of their most famous attacks was the WannaCry ransomware outbreak that affected hundreds of thousands of computers across more than 150 countries. Hospitals, transportation systems, and corporations were paralyzed. The total global damage was estimated in the billions. Lazarus Group has also stolen tens of millions of dollars from international banks through advanced techniques that manipulate the SWIFT transaction network. Their combination of resources, skill, and government backing elevates them far above typical criminal hackers. Two, Marcus Hutchins, be the protector. With a complicated past, Marcus Hutchins became an overnight hero when he discovered a kill switch that stopped the WannaCry ransomware attack. His quick thinking halted what could have become one of the most destructive digital disasters in history. However, his earlier involvement in creating banking malware placed him in a morally complex position. Before becoming a cybersecurity researcher, Hutchins had developed code that criminals use to steal financial data. Law enforcement estimated that his malware contributed to substantial monetary losses among affected victims. His story illustrates the thin line between black hat and white hat in the hacker world. Redemption is possible, but the past cannot be ignored. One, Evgeny Bogachev, the billion dollar cyber criminal. Evgeny Bogachev is considered one of the most financially damaging hackers ever tracked by law enforcement. He created and controlled the Game Over Zeus botnet, a global network of infected computers used to steal banking credentials and deploy ransomware. Victims worldwide lost an estimated $100 million or more through unauthorized transfers and extortion payments. Some agencies believe the real figure may be several times higher due to unreported incidents. Bogachev lived a luxurious lifestyle while running his operations and remains one of the most wanted cyber criminals on the planet. His skills, scale of operations, and ability to evade capture make him the top entry on this list. The stories on this list show how dangerous the digital world becomes when intelligence, motive, and opportunity collide. Some hackers sought profit, some sought curiosity, and others pursued ideology. Yet every one of them changed cybersecurity forever and left a mark on the world that cannot be erased. If you enjoyed this deep dive into the most dangerous hackers on the planet, make sure you like the video, share it with friends, subscribe to the channel, and comment below which hackers shocked you the most. Your engagement keeps this channel growing and helps bring more high quality investigations and digital mysteries your way. Thank you for watching. Stay alert, stay informed, and protect your digital world.